there, it's currently October 29th, 2017. We are doing a tarot card reading and an angel card reading for the energy of the day. Thank you so much for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to this video. I really appreciate it. Um, so all we're going to do is just kind of connect to um, basically the higher good and I'm pulling out a few tarot cards as well as uh, we're going to pull out, well, whatever pops up. How about that? Ooh. I want to apologize also for not getting my video out yesterday. I was a little bit busy teaching a class, so um, this was the quickest time that I could get this done. <sighs> okay, I'm feeling like deep breaths are really important today um, because it's really important that people are feeling connected to um, themselves. I'm also feeling like it's important that people feel like um, they're not in their heads too much and so that's why the breathing comes in because when we take deep breaths we kind of get out of our head and um, we can get better in touch with ourselves okay so opportunity to forgive so it I'm hearing like shallow hide so it's really important that we are um, dealing with our negative side so if we have something in ourselves that we need to change we need to forgive ourselves for the things that we've done or the things that we've said and that's where breathing also helps because we can tell ourselves, you know what, it's all good, it's okay. So um, yes, there's just, we're going through a time of change and transition um, and we're really working on our intuition and, and just hearing, hearing that voice inside of our head that's telling us to do something. Um, so if that's related to changing yourself, then that's what you need to do. So Nine of Pentacles is saying that we really need to compromise right now um, because we're dealing with negative sides of, our, of ourselves we have to make sure that um, other people are doing the same. So in terms of partnerships, just making sure that um, you're both agreeing. So um, Nine of Pentacles um, also suggests that um, we have a lot of strength right now because of our ability to know who we are. And if you don't know who you are, um, then again, we're, we're, we have to like take those deep breaths and really get in touch and teach ourselves that it's okay to just be. It's okay to just be you, that sort of thing, okay? So a few more. Four of Wands, so it's saying that uh, today is Sunday, so you may be feeling like there's some well-deserved um, honor and respect. That's what's coming up. So if it's that you need to sit on your butt, then you need to sit on your butt, and you need to be respected and, and honor that, okay? Um, I'm also hearing that somebody watching has a lot of talent. Um, it could be... Like, I feel like I have a lot of talent. It could be that uh, there's someone watching that has a lot of talent. Regardless, um, it's about not having fear when it comes to doing, fulfilling your dreams, satisfying your needs, that sort of thing. Um, speaking your mind, that's another big one. I'm feeling really scratchy in my throat. So you may find that it's a time for clearing and cleansing. Still getting rid of a lot of um, old stuff that's stuck in us, such as um, if there's a lot of negativity, it may be a great day for um, just doing some meditation practice, that sort of thing. So the Hierophant is a person that needs to, um, well, I'm hearing it's a reality check. So it's like sometimes we have to hear what other people think about us in order to change. So maybe asking um, other people what their thoughts and views and opinions are um, about a topic. It could also be about um, what they think of you. So it could be like, do you feel like I'm an honest person? Do you feel like I'm, um, do I come across as a happy person? So this is just a very small example, but the Hierophant says that we need to learn through, from others um, if we've done enough soul searching. Uh, if you're going through a time of transition or change, you want to better yourself, you have to learn from other people. So uh, another great day for socializing, I would say, Three of Wands is saying that it's okay to be um, really, really good at stuff. Uh, that comes down to self-worth. So it's saying that if you're paying attention to um, the details too much, it could backfire. But in order to be really, really good at something, you have to really know those details inside and out. So it may be a great day to um, realize that um, what you're good at or uh, make a decision that you're going to start pursuing your dreams and uh, really putting things into reality today, okay? 
Um, so I actually really like the energy that's happening today. It's very positive. So Six of Swords is saying that we're moving away from the old and we're walking into the new. It could be you're um, learning a new topic, um, you're going to a counselor, uh, whatever it is, it's saying that you really need to look at yourself deeply today. And um, when you start seeing yourself for who you really are, you're actually going to feel like peaceful, like that you're actually moving in a good direction. So you, if, I would say that today, depending on how you're feeling, is going to indicate what the rest of the week is going to be like. So just make sure that you're letting go of fear today and you're um, really getting into um, yourself and the things that you want for you. So I hope you enjoyed this reading and I'm also going to be doing a weekly reading shortly. Bye!